Hi there. Today we are going to be working in the testable question foldable. You already have a video showing you how to create the foldable and how to put it into your notebook. But now we're going to open up to page six where that foldable is. And we're gonna actually fill out the pieces inside. This white piece of lined paper underneath the flaps. We're gonna figure out what it means when a testable question is specific, measurable, observable, and can be used in an investigation. So for now, I'm flipping my book around so I can write correctly. But I promise that when I'm done writing um, each section, I will make sure to turn it around so you can see what I've written. I'm going to use black and gray and maybe a little bit of red marker. I'm using markers so it can stand out nice on the video. You should be using pen or pencil, whatever is appropriate for your grade level. So when a question is testable, we're gonna put the other two flaps down, leave open the first one, not testable, specific. When it's specific, we mean that it can identify, so I'm gonna do a little bullet, can identify both, I'm gonna put the both in red, the independent and dependent variables, which we are going to be talking about in another video. Independent and dependent, I'm doing that in gray, variables. And we're gonna do another bullet point. This is focused on one idea. We're gonna do that in red. So again, if a testable question is specific, we are saying that it can be identified it identifies both the independent and dependent variables and is focused on one idea. Now, in my example, it does go a little bit out of the foldable and that's okay. Ideally, it'd be great to keep it inside of the foldable line, but it's not a huge deal if it goes outside. I'm going to draw a line using green that separates the information for specific from the information for measurable and observable to then the information at the bottom for completed by an investigation. Okay, so now what do I mean when I say that it's observable or measurable? Well, similar to the last one, um, it can, an, a lab can be done, right? An investigation can be done. It can be done to answer the question. And another bullet point is that we allow for the use of, and I'm gonna use a different color again, I'm gonna use red, of tools, observations, or models. So in order for it to be measurable or observable, we need to make sure that a lab, an activity, an experiment can be done and that we can use tools, observations, and or models to answer and see those questions being answered. And for the last one, we, need, we know um, it can be tested through an experiment when it supports 
empirical, fancy word, or scientific areas, right? It's going to be a lab that makes sense. And another bullet point, it provides, we're going to use a different color again, data collection opportunities. So we have three sections written here for our testable question foldable. At the end of this video, I will post a picture of this and I'll have it stay there for a few moments so you can pause the video at the end and make sure you have everything copied for this section. Alrighty, I will catch you in the next video.